Hey everybody, how's it going? It's a Daily Shooter, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Grayman Tactical Rigid Molly Panel, which goes on the back of your car or truck seat that holds pretty much anything that you could attach through straps or molly. It's a really cool setup. Now, typically when I do barrel and blade unboxings, I just show you guys what's in the box. This time I thought I would show you guys everything that came in the box as it is installed, because this month was the Grayman Tactical Month, so let's check it out. Okay, so here is a closer look. I'll try not to get in front of the camera too much. There's a lot of sunlight, so the exposure might be off just a little bit here, but this is our Grayman Tactical Rigid Molly Panel. So this is uh, what attaches to the back of your seat, again, car or truck. This one, I believe, is 15 inches by 20 inches, and it comes with a couple different straps and different ways you can attach it to your seat. So right now, I have uh, two clips that strap around my headrest, and that's what's holding it on. These clips can be removed. This whole panel can be removed in just a matter of seconds. Or it also comes with D-rings. You could take your headrest off and then put the D-ring in it and then put your headrest back on and that D-ring is going to hold this panel in place. And then it also comes with these lower straps there as well that go around the base of your seat so that uh, that basically holds everything in place. And it makes this nice rigid mount that you can mount absolutely anything to uh, as long as you can strap it on or it has pre-existing Molly attachments. So again, we have the uh, top two straps holding everything together. Now it also came with these rifle or pistol straps right here. So these basically attach, it's got a soft side and a, and a rigid side, but you just simply adjust these and with the either the stock or the brace or whatever you have and then around the handguard, you can go ahead and you can attach a rifle or a pistol to the back of your plate. Now try and keep in mind, you don't want to keep it there overnight. Somebody you know sees something that's advantageous, all they have to do is simply break the window, undo these straps and take it. It's not as safe in any way. It's just something that will hold it there. So you can go ahead and attach that. And again, being you know able to attach anything you want, you can put a bunch of mag pouches right there. You can put you know accessories. I'm going to go ahead and put my med kit up here, so I'll have my med kit magazines and anything else that I might need, just a you know quick grab or something like that. Now, along with this kit in barrel and blade, we also got a seatbelt strap cutter uh, that simply just wraps around that as well. But if somebody in the back seat, you know, you get into an accident or you crash, whatever, somebody needs to escape, all they have to do is just reach over, undo that. Go ahead and cut their seatbelt and you're good to go. And that came with our barrel and blade box this month as well. Now, another thing that came in our barrel and blade box this month that I installed, and I'm trying to keep my, you know, whole body out of the camera here, but we have this uh, canteen holder right here. It's a nice canteen holder. It locks on the top. It has pouches on both sides, so you can add stuff to that, just give you a little bit more storage. And then it also came with, if we unclip this here, it also came with a canteen, so we have a little bit of extra water. And the nice thing is, because this is a removable molly system i can simply undo the buttons that are on the bottom right here take this canteen out with the canteen holder and take it with me so it doesn't have to stay on here once it's attached and i think that's pretty nice another thing that came in our barrel and blade box i know it's kind of difficult to see but i'll see if i can roll in images is going to be a single mag pouch that i have to the side right there so a single mag pouch we have a cantina cantina holder we have our gray man tactical back panel right here we have the seat belt cutter and I, I think it was a really cool box i mean if you're into you know being prepared on the road this is definitely something that'll come in handy now if you have something that doesn't strap or use molly in order to attach like for instance i have uh, this tourniquet holder right here that just has a regular pocket clip on the back but this holds my tourniquet i can come around like this and simply lock that into one of the squares on top here. And now I have a tourniquet, which is very easily accessible. So I can simply grab that. Now it does move a little bit because it's not attached with a strap, but it's not coming off and it's not gonna slide around because it's attached to one of these squares in the bottom like it would in your pocket so, uh, or on your belt. So I have uh, that there. Again, you can add just about anything you want. I think I'm gonna kind of make this a uh, emergency and medical setup myself. So we're gonna have a med kit, we're gonna have a tourniquet, we're gonna have all my medical stuff be located right here. And then if I need to, or I'm bringing an AR or some type of self-defense something with me, I can go ahead and I can add it there. So it's a pretty cool setup. Uh, you get all the instructions and everything that you need. And uh, I definitely like it. I had one of these in my older truck, which I traded in for this one. And uh, they're, they're definitely useful. It's just, you know, big, 
rigid panels like 15 by 20 inches and you know you can put whatever you want on it so instead of doing a standard unboxing to show you guys everything that came in the box i thought i would actually install it and show you guys the setup that you could have uh if you got this month's barrel of blade tactical box so definitely worth checking out i want to thank all of you very much for watching please like subscribe have a great day